guys, I'm so excited because I am here to film an um, unboxing of happy mail that I have received from my very beautiful friend and pen pal in the United States, Stephanie at Sweet Crafty Girls. So we agreed to do a um, carousel swap. So we just done an all heart one a couple of months ago. And now um, we I have received her carousel um, um, crafting and happy mail and I am almost done with mine so I'll be sending her off very shortly so I have cut open the box but I have not had a look inside yet I'm pretty sure this is our carousel swap because I actually opened and did an unboxing yesterday of her um, rack and I thought that might have been the carousel swap but it wasn't which means this one is the carousel swap so let's take a look inside Mm. oh uh, my goodness you guys you guys know how much i love receiving carousel and playing with carousel and it's such a gorgeous carnival themed collection oh my god i am beyond words about how excited i am so let's take everything out and have a look <gasps> oh uh, my gosh it is a popcorn box that Stephanie decorated and filled with goodies and I'm so excited about opening that then we have what appears to be a tag flip which um oh, like look at all the colors I I have no words I adore Stephanie and I'm obsessed with her crafting she uses pinks mints iridescents sherbet colors like hits me in all the feels like with all the feels just love that oh my god and she has the most divine sequins mix you guys know how much i love showing off stephanie on my channel i just think she comes up with awesome stuff lollipop in the most beautiful bright pink yum so not going to show my daughters <laughs> they're going to steal that from me if they knew and look at her look at her decoration like she has filled this up with beautiful pink glitter baubles which i've never seen before i don't have any of these in my collection so i'm gonna have to save up every single one of those lots of little embellishments which i'm gonna look at closer in a minute a few more items here i'm just gonna take it all out of the box because i don't want to rush and show too much now and show you all of it close in closer detail in a minute Few more items there stephanie stephanie is so generous like she goes all out to purchase things and make things that she knows i will love <gasps> oh my god i'm speechless i have never owned this ticket cut apart from carousel and i have been dying to buy i've never never had the sheet before thank you so much stephanie i have been wanting this in forever thank you thank you thank you where did you even get this it is literally the one thing from carousel i have never owned and have always wanted <sighs> Thank you, my darling. Thank you so much. Oh, you sweet person. You are really so kind. Oh, how lucky am I? And she's wrapped up all these extra packages inside here. All these packages which I will open. And look at all that loveliness inside. Where do you get all your pretty shreds, Stephanie? They're so pretty. And she's decorated that with that gorgeous um, um, carnival tent paper from Carousel and the giraffe. And it says, so sweet. You are so sweet, Stephanie. You are so sweet to me. Like on the same day, I received a second parcel from Stephanie, what you see here. I'm so, I'm absolutely so lucky. So I wanted to look at this one first. It is a beautiful little shaker ferris wheel oh my god so i i don't actually know if stephanie has a um silhouette or a cricket um so I, i'm gonna guess that she doesn't and she actually uses a die cut to make 
this and you guys it is so pretty it is absolutely stunning she's used gold and glitter accents and all the little seats in the on the ferris wheel are gold and look at her sequins mix so pretty little tiny gold sequins that she's mixed with pastel stars how pretty is that thank you stephanie i love it i absolutely love it okay and then she has sent me a whole bunch of um <clears throat> embellishments look at this i've never received cotton candy before like handmade cotton candy embellishments so she's basically made these she's like die cut these cones out of a beautiful mint paper and added like fluffy cotton candy and this beautiful i don't know if you can see that but this beautiful sequins mix which is made out of like an iridescent paper so pretty and she's backed that onto some gorgeous polka dot vellum i'm obsessed with that i can't wait to use these on my projects oh so pretty thank you stephanie and this is her version of some carousel butterflies oh my god oh they're so pretty i don't know where you got those like i recognize the top layer that's from the same punch i have but the layers behind it she has got she must have a different punch but it is so intricate and she knows how much i love adding layered butterflies to my um crafting so really thoughtful of you stephanie thank you i don't know if i can use these they're just too pretty <laughs> i just want to look at them all day that's the thing with Stephanie's, like when I receive things from Stephanie, I never want to use it. I just want to look at them in the packet all day because they're just far too pretty. And I don't, I don't feel like I can do justice to my, like to her project, to her products when I put them in my, um, put in my projects. Oh my God. Look at these. Oh, they're little tickets that she's made into little shaker pop. Oh, I've got to take these out. They're little, um... Oh, the little tickets. I'm like lost for words, but the little carousel tickets, right? That Stephanie has popped into little shaker pockets. This is the prettiest thing. Oh, and she's printed out her own ephemera, carousel ephemera, so that she can make it any size she wants. Look how pretty the sequins mix, the tickets. They're so petite. I adore um I adore it when I receive like tiny embellishments, which Stephanie does a lot of when she makes tiny embellishments. Um it just makes me squeal and it just I don't know, it just hits the spot. Anna Ephemeris um 32, she does that as well. She likes to make really tiny embellishments, and I just think they're adorable. Another two sets. Oh my god, look at that like pink and white striped one there so pretty stephanie i admire this so much oh and those pretty pink jemmies with the gold on it god girl your layering is so on point so beautiful and this one oh, from my one of my favorite cutter parts she's grabbed one of those black and white cutter parts and she's put it in another shaker pocket so pretty so so pretty and she's got pom-poms down the side and it's that cotton candy cart i want to buy one of these like cotton candy cuts for real so i can make myself cotton candy anytime i want <laughs> look at these sequins mix oh my god look at those little tiny little like cog sequins in aqua yellow and like iridescent white so pretty and the other thing i do with all my um happy mail from stephanie is i keep all of her sequins mixes because they are abs they're like lollies i could they're so good i could eat them i keep all her sequins mixes they're my favorite sequins mix out of all the sequins mixes in my collection stephanie's are my favorite that's beautiful stephanie that is just beautiful great job and i think stephanie has a fuse tool because i noticed her fusing a lot of her um shaker pockets which probably saves her a lot more time because she otherwise hand stitches everything which must take forever let's open this one here 
So it is a popcorn box. Oh, I don't want to take it out. It's just too pretty. So she's hot glued that with a beautiful gold bow at the top. And I think, but don't get me wrong, I think... Hello? Okay, you do your wee wee. Okay, you let me know when you're done. I think these are Hobby Lobby bows, but I could be wrong. goodness you guys look at that <gasps> wow it's unfortunately squashed a little bit um in transit but you can see all the layering she's done on the front she's used some beautiful um carousel chipboards on that gorgeous horse or unicorn not a horse and then she's popped that onto a shaker star with some pink sequins and inside she has gifted me lots and lots of goodies. Let's take a look. We have, oh, beautiful bow that she's dying cut. Stephanie, that is absolutely stunning. And here we go, she's done her hand stitching. Like, how long do you reckon it takes Stephanie to do that? I'll be right. She has, um die cut this beautiful beautiful bow for me out of that carousel swan paper and it has a tiny little like star embellishment hanging off it but i don't i don't want to open that because it's just too beautiful it's just too beautiful to use i can't use that if i use it then i won't have it again <laughs> if that makes sense oh dear and what is, the, oh my God, are you serious? Oh my God, Stephanie, you didn't. She's made me my own little jar of sequins mix. Stephanie. Other than that pink round sequins, I don't have any of these other sequins in my collection. Again, I can't use that, it's way too pretty. <laughs> I save up and use all the sequins, Stephanie, that you put in my packaging and I use them in my shakers, but not this one. This one's all mine. <sighs> Thank you. That's so well presented and extremely thoughtful of you. It's got its own little pink like scoop as well. I'm so lucky. I'm really so truly lucky to have you as a pen pal. You spoil me with... <gasps> Oh, look at that rosette. Oh, Stephanie, this would have taken you forever. You made your own little cotton candy and layered that all up. Oh, my God. And then here we go with the, like, hand stitching. How do you do it? Honestly, I cannot believe you do all this by hand. It just must take Stephanie so long to make. Oh, wow. I'm... Just lost for words. Look at this. At first I thought she sent me another lollipop, but this one's actually like um, a plastic one. <laughs> Perfect for carousel crafting. Look at those divine colors. I do secretly wish that was edible because it's so pretty, <laughs> but I'll eat that one instead. <laughs> so pretty. And she has made me one of her beautiful, like, shaker star wands. So sweet. And look at that. She's added a little carousel button on the back. How adorable is that? Oh, I love that you put the little enamel um, roller skate as well. So stunning. I am just going to put everything back in here and not use any of it. Sorry, Stephanie. It's far too pretty for me to like put on my projects. I am just going to adore and admire this like that. And I'm gonna pull things out and I'm gonna look at it and stare at it and put it back because I don't, it's too pretty to use. It's so beautiful. I will not do it justice if I put it in my projects. Thank you so much for that. 
what next? Let's open one of these gifts. Look at the paper. It's such pretty paper. So not only is Stephanie an amazing crafter, she knows like what to buy. She knows exactly what to buy. <gasps> you guys. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god, Stephanie. <laughs> I have never received these dimensional stickers. I get like projects from my pen pals with these stickers on it and I have been wanting them forever. And she Stephanie has been so kind to purchase two packets for me. Thank you, Stephanie, from the bottom of my heart. I'm so grateful. You are so generous and thank you, thank you, thank you for buying these for me. Oh, that's going straight into my box of All Heart um, supplies because I'm going to be using this with All Heart. Oh, they're so pretty in real life. They really are. And you can't buy Le Petites in Australia. You can only get them in the States at Hobby Lobby. Oh, we seriously need a Hobby Lobby here. <laughs> Okay, let's open this one here. So um, Stephanie has decorated a polka dot pink treat bag with um, some ephemera from Carousel. Love that giraffe. And one of my favorite things about Carousel is the mix of black and white designs and pastel colors. Uh, let's not ruin that. Let's just cut the top. So I'm gonna like ruin it if I try to open that otherwise. Stephanie, you did it. Oh, okay. So Stephanie um, did a little haul of um, Valentine's stuff that she picked up. And I was like, oh, please, Stephanie, can I pay you some money? Could you pick some up for me? She's like, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Um, but I think she accidentally like missed a sale or something like that. I'm not sure what went wrong, but she, um, anyway, she, she's got me some and look at this guys. Look at this. It's red and pink and white and it says be mine and it's these beautiful Valentine's banners. Oh, and the little tiny like shaker jars and the theme of this goes so well with crepe paper la la love and I love crafting with la la love during um, Valentine's. La la love is not it's not very popular amongst the crafting community because it's got a lot of blues and themes in it that don't agree with a lot of people, but I'm obsessed with it. I love La La Love. I used a lot of La La Love in um, the layered banners that I sent to Alicia at Love Letter Generation. Oh my God, these are so cute. Oh, thank you, Stephanie. Oh, and look at that. Valentine's Day stickers with gold accents. Oh, I'm so... Thank you, Stephanie. I've got one of each now, and I'm looking forward to playing with this next February. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Hand stitching again, zigzag hand stitching all around. Now, I'm not sure whether Stephanie intends for me to keep them as like shaker pockets because they're so pretty as is or to take them out. But she has made a super chunky bag topper with two layers of doilies, actually three layers of doilies. Oh my God, look at the chunkiness in that. And that wee little like cotton candy in there oh Stephanie I am obsessed with your crafting seriously I just I just I know I'm supposed to take it out but she has put so much effort into hand stitching this that I I just don't want to like cut it off I don't want to spoil it I want to keep it all in its shaker pocket that's me I'm one of those weirdos that like to keep products in their packaging because it always feels brand new that way <laughs> And it's got a gorgeous little like pink star charm hanging off it. If I could just, there we go. Beautiful little like pink star charm right there. Oh, Stephanie, obsessed. I love this. Everything I love about Carousel, all in one project. 
beautiful. And then she's made me a little vellum shaker. This one's quite flat. Can you hear that? Stunning. Hand stitching all around once again. Oh my God, lots and lots of that sequins mix, but I'm not gonna use the sequins mix because it came in a beautiful shaker pocket, which I will adore forever. Beautiful. Okay, let's now move on to another gift. No idea what this could be. Oh my God, oh my God, Stephanie. Oh my God. Oh my God, she has got me these giant paper clips in the most divine pink colors like pink caddy stripe this mauve like lilac this pink <gasps> you know what i'm going to do when i finish filming i'm going to be crafting with these i'm going to use i'm going to make banners out of these and my sweet story collection so beautiful thank you stephanie you cannot get these here. I've looked, I've looked, I've looked, and I cannot find that beautiful candy stripe on all these pink giant ones. The closest thing I've seen is a shop called Smiggle, which is like a little um, kids stationery shop, and they do have these gigantic paper clips, but not in the colors I want. Oh, thank you, Stephanie. I'm gonna put that aside straight away because that's what I'm gonna be crafting with today. Beautiful, let's open. No, I'm going to save the best for last. I'm going to save the best for last. I'm going to move on to something else. <laughs> um, so in the video that I've now lost forever, I absolutely swoon because of all the products in Carousel, this is the one I have wanted the most in Cray Paper Carousel, Maggie Holmes Carousel Collection, and is the one thing I have never owned and Stephanie, out of the kindness of her heart, has found and sent me one sheet of it. Oh my god. It is the only crepe paper Maggie Holmes 12 by 12 where everything is perforated as they should be. How can I craft with this? It is my only sheet and it's absolutely beautiful. It is beauty wise it's nothing compared with things that she has crafted for me but I I'm, I'm completely in two minds now about whether I use this maybe I'll allow myself to use a one strip that's it the rest of it I'm hoarding forever I'm so weird like that seriously I'm so weird okay um she has ah okay so in the rack that I just received from um Stephanie she packaged up like one of her products in this beautiful like treat bag which i suspected when i opened that it was a daiso product and it is and i have not seen this in australia so thank you so much it's in my favorite aurora um color i think daiso just it just describes everything that's iridescent as aurora so i love everything aurora from daiso beautiful treat bags thank you and i went a little bit crazy with treat bags in the last package i sent stephanie i sent her so many treat bags that I think she's like, yep, okay, yep, I'm sick of them now. <laughs> Poor Stephanie. But I know how much she likes them. That's why I sent her heaps. And I love hauling them. I love hauling and purchasing like heaps of something for my pen pals. <gasps> Look at the, oh my God. <gasps> Look at these mini banners. Oh, they're so pretty and they're in colors. So I think they're for Valentine's crafting, but I think they're in colors that you could use on any crafting carousel, sweet story. Oh, how, how pretty. How pre oh my God. Look at these. Stephanie, these are so cute. They're little, um, suck that down pretty good. <laughs> um, they're little envelopes and they say, hello, love. Oh. That is beautiful. These are gift tags, actually. Those were mini banners, but these are actually little gift tags. I think what I'll use these for is when I make a um, when I make a little Happy Mail package, and I put it in a little treat bag. I can use these gift tags to tie around the top. 
beautiful. No, I don't need to wait till Valentine's Day to play with those. Thank you. Oh, she's bought me a lot of stuff. And that is, these are like, there's heaps. Considering that box isn't very huge, she has packed a punch in there. She really has. Oh my god, I, I spot some more Hobby Lobby products in here. Once again, I will reiterate that we do not have a Hobby Lobby in Australia. So anything Stephanie gives me from Hobby Lobby, I am, I've died and gone to heaven. Oh my god! Look at these iridescent stars. Stars, hearts. Oh, they're so cute and beautiful. Oh, that's going in the all heart box. Oh, glossy layered dimensional stickers. These are so pretty. That's that's actually not very cheap, you know. Like I thought, Hobby Lobby La Petite's collection was like inexpensive. Hope she got this on discount because that's not really that cheap. Oh my god, they're two layers. There's two layers in each of these stickers and they're glossy and enamel. So my cup of tea. Thank you, Stephanie. And look at these arts. Oh, they're so pretty and cute. Look at that one with the moustache. Speaking of moustaches, I was playing, you know, that game called Guess Who, where you flip face faces. I was playing that with my four-year-old and um, she doesn't know that moustaches are called moustaches. She calls them chinabar, which is a made a name that she completely made up. So whenever she sees moustaches, she calls them chinabars. So I can't wait to show her this little heart with a chinabar. And she's obsessed with hearts. Oh my gosh, she steals all my heart stickers and plays with them and sticks it everywhere. <laughs> oh, how cute. Thank you, Stephanie. You spoiled me. You totally spoiled me there. Now, I just want to make sure that I have opened everything except this and saving the best for last. So, I'm going to open this and then saving the best for last. Okay, good, 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 good. I'm so messy when I open things. I feel terrible. I'm going to try and just... <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh my god. Look at these jammies. Oh, I've never seen the Paper Studio before. I don't know what brand it is. Now, I have exactly the same gem stickers, but when I bought them at the time, I was like, gosh, they only come in that one large size. I really wish I had one that had like smaller sizes because that's what I do with my embellishments. I mix them with large and small jammies, and look at this. Perfect. Large, medium, small. Stephanie, this is brilliant. Thank you. Oh, they're just so sparkly. So sparkly. And I use sparkly gems, specifically sparkly gems, in lots of my crafting. Beautiful. Oh, my God. I do not have either of these. You cannot get these here in Australia. Either we're really behind and our treat back treat bags like aren't as current as the ones in the states i think it'd be the other way around because we're a little bit closer to japan than you guys are but it's either that or they just make different products between sydney and um america because i've never seen that it says the darkest nights produce the brightest stars i was actually just watching um stargazing with my two kids and my husband the other night and we saw, saw shooting stars so that's really special oh and look at these treat bags. It's in the shape of a coffee cup. What the hell, girl? Oh, it's pink. You know I love hand sketch designs. That's just, that's perfect. These, I think I'm going to use these to gift like sequins mixes to my pen pals. Stunning. Thank you for everything, Stephanie. I am now ready to open your tag flip. I have been most excited about this because I adore your tag flips. I also made you a carousel tag flip um, amongst some other goodies that I'll be obviously making for you in um, my outgoing sort to you. But you and I, oh my God, we just know what, we, what each other likes. <laughs> 
I'm so glad I saved this for last. Look, okay, first of all, wow. <laughs> Look at the colors on that. <gasps> oh my gosh. Stephanie, this is so pretty. Look at all those colors and the glitter balls. Oh, so pretty. Oh my god. It's it's basically all shaker tags, which means she has hand stitched every single tag you see in this tag flip. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, on the front we have beautiful pom pom tassel. Pom pom trim, I beg your pardon. One of those beautiful cute girl tassels with the gold dipped ends. She's made me this beautiful, beautiful ice cream charm. It's like gold on the bottom and it's got a pink sequins ice cream with gorgeous eyelash trim wrapped all around it. I think this might be a little bit tangled, but this might be on purpose. I'm not sure. I think she did it deliberately. Yeah, she's just tied it on. Oh, and she's got that beautiful like pink fabric around it. Isn't she talented? Stephanie is so talented. She hand makes everything. Like, I don't know where she finds the time. Look at that first tag. It's just simply a, like, distressed ticket in the prettiest pink. Oh, look at that. That's the ephemera ticket. From carousel and she's put good stuff on the front here she's used that banner she gave me i don't know if I've, it's down here somewhere but it's she's used that pink banner in this project in this tag and it's so pretty and a ticket from the ticket pack that i'll never use <laughs> it's just too good to use wow 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 i love your tag flips, Stephanie. They're my favorite things to receive from you. Your tag flips are divine and so girly. Look at the mint and the pink jemmies. Oh. Look at that beautiful rosette. Simple layers. Very, very effective. Look at all this prettiness. She has sent me the sequins mix before in her last package and I'm obsessed with it and I want more. <laughs> and now I have more. But I'm not going to open this because every single one of these tags are a piece of art and I'm not going to bring myself to open it. I want to be very careful. I just don't want to break anything or tear anything because Stephanie's put so much effort into it. Look at this. This is unusual. Okay, so... Stephanie has actually made a shaker to follow the shape of this tag before layering it. And she's used one of those classic, she's used one of those classic um, Maggie Holmes gold word stickers. Then there's this very layered number here. Oops, let's be careful here. This is what I mean. I've got to be extra careful. I think that one went here. A little tag that says sweet and the softest little fluffy donut there. This beautiful tag. Oh, wow. So gorgeous, Stephanie. I love this. I love that she's made a little vellum shaker for the ice cream cart and then back that onto another piece of cardstock which i think is another cut apart from carousel and then on top of all of that she's put it into a clear shaker and hand stitched around it so beautiful thank you stephanie from the bottom of my heart i adore everything i adore everything you purchased for me and i am obsessed with everything that you've made for me Thank you, Stephanie. I can't wait to send out my carousel goodies to you. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Thank you, Stephanie, for being my pen pal. I'm excited to, um, you know, organize our next swap. 
and I hope you and everyone else is having a lovely weekend. Bye guys!